One year ago, wildfires in Los Angeles resulted in historic destruction and death. But in the war on wildfires, there are now some unlikely soldiers on the front lines. Okay. Students from Valley Christian High School in San Jose, California. Wildfires have just been a constant force in my life, like growing up in California. I also remember like in the hill adjacent to my house, I saw like flames over the horizon and I'm just like, I feel totally helpless. And it just seems wrong sending people into the fire to put it out. Firefighters work tirelessly to protect life and property, but they need help. So these resourceful students are leveraging drones. These towers that we're standing in front of has already detected a fire. Once it detects a fire, it sends the coordinates to the drone and says, hey, there's a fire in this location. The drone will actually get to the coordinate. And once it's adjusted, it's going to release its payload. Boom. Here it goes. We hit it. So now wait, it's gonna actually, there you Woo! go. They put it out. It happened, it's out. That's it. So that must bring you such joy. Actually, I got a little emotional <laughs> because it took so long mm -hmm. to get us to this point. The group just made it to the finals of an $11 million X Prize competition. That tower detection system is already in use in Orange County. It too was made by a teenager. It detects for the three main signatures of wildfire. There's the smoke, heat plume, and the flame. And if you actually look at it right now, you can see that this is constantly spinning around. Yeah. Uh, there's a camera up on there, and that's obviously what's looking at the fire. Now they want to add the drones and docking stations. Those drones could launch this, the same time we launched our apparatus. They could get on scene, utilize their extinguishing agent, and that, that would hope, um, ideally, uh, hold the fire in check mm -hmm. until uh, our fire engines and our firefighters and our helicopters and our air tankers could all get on scene and, and hold it. I have to give a big shout out to Orange County Fire for letting us be here and take over this morning. I also want to tell you that most fires don't start in a place that's really easy to access. So firefighters might take minutes or hours to get there without roads, but a drone like this could get there in seconds. And that could be a game changer when it comes to this big war on wildfires, Michael. Yeah, I mean, it really is amazing, Ginger, but those, those don't look like your typical drones. No, no. Kaizen Aerospace let us look at some of their fleet here, and they've got drones of all sizes. But take this one, for example. It is a 13-foot behemoth. This is one drone, wow. and it could carry up to 1,000 pounds of water or a payload of anything. So imagine what that could do when it comes to at least putting a pause, if not putting a fire out. Yeah, that is 13 feet. Wow, okay. Well, Ginger, mm -hmm. thank you. Thank you for bringing that to us. We really appreciate, appreciate you.